What's up, everybody? ADS Play 101 here, and welcome to, I guess you would say, my return to a playthrough that was nearly two whole years in in limbo. Um, bravely default. Bravely default. Uh, this is a game that I actually started back in, well, on November 8th of 2022, but, um, I stopped playing it around November 12, 2022 due to the fact that I kind of got bored with it and there was other games that caught my attention. So this ended up literally getting caught in like limbo and I didn't really think about it until recently. So uh, my end goal here is to continue on with the game, um, complete it and uh, move on to the sequel, which is called Bravely Second. But you know, uh, during the remainder of this playthrough, one, because I'm so behind, two, because there's like this, these difficulty spikes, which is very common during the, uh, during the era that this game came out, RPGs like this, they had like terrible difficulty spikes. Like it'll be in one area that it was like, you know, normal difficulty. Then immediately after that, it's like just it's like the difficulty just skyrockets so because of that i do end up using codes to try to like increase my stats and my um i do try to increase the oh, i don't like the fact that this damn thing there we go i do try to, <laughs> to try to increase my stats and my levels um just to help me get to a certain point and then uh I plan on, you know, turning them off and playing the game normally, but, you know, I want to beat this game and move on to the second one. And uh, considering that I'm two years behind, pretty much, I just want to hurry up and get through with the game. So don't fault me. You know, normally I play the game normally, you know, with honor and all that jazz, but right now I just don't care. So you're going to see that. So with that being said, hope you guys enjoy the remainder of this playthrough and I'll see you guys or bravely default. Can you tell us why they were chasing you? The Sky Knights are a friend. I'm gonna try to bolt. Like, I'm gonna try to rush through this. The Duchy of Eternia has put forth an agenda of anti-crystallism. Anti-crystallism? A new way of thinking, based upon the idea of a society no longer dependent upon the crystals. It brands the crystal orthodoxy as a heretic faith and the Vestals its minions. It was the philosophy I was raised upon. When the Chasm appeared, every one of the Eternian forces was given the order to capture the Vestals. They said the Vestals and the crystals they tend were the sinkhole's cause. That's not possible. Agnes has been fighting this whole time to fix what happened to Narende. I know. I'm sorry. You've nothing to apologize for. All of this paints the duchy in a suspicious light, don't you think? Perhaps they know more of the chasm's true cause than they let off. I cannot imagine we've seen the last of them. If any of you wish to go, do it now. I'll not blame you. I'm staying with you. I just told the king as much. I'm in as well. I need to see for myself whether my people are right or wrong. And playing escort is my job. I'll not cede it to anyone. If none of you will listen to reason... This is so exciting, Agnes! You're finally headed back to the Wind Crystal side! Yes, to Anshine, the land of sand and time, and to the Temple of Wind. Anshine? The land of sand and time? What's it like there? There's one thing I didn't like about games like this is that they always talk too damn much. They always talk too damn much. I can't even tell you when the last time I played this game. This was like... This easily had to be like 2021 when I started this playthrough. And I'm still playing it all these years later. I'm just now finishing it, getting to the point where I'm going to finish it all these years later.
Chapter one. I never beat chapter one. S sit and stay our trick. Tr sit and stay our tricks for dogs. We've arrived at Anshine. Still no wind. Are these desert places normally supposed to be windy? When they're the site of the wind crystal, they are. This stillness shouldn't be possible. The wind carried all manner of blessings to this land in days past. It was the kingdom's lifeblood. I see. All the more reason to hurry then. Which way to the temple? From here we need only head... Uh, we ought to make a for... Uh, we must ignore anything she says. Anya's reason is getting lost to an art form. I'm impressed you made it to Kaldisla. Just a moment. My journal details much of Ansheim's topography. A clockwork metropolis nestled in Harina's sandy bosom. Here, time, above all, is sacred. A massive timepiece crowns the kingdom, fueled as all of Ansheim by the ceaseless currents originating from the Temple of Wind to the south. Quite thorough, isn't it? Sounds as if you've been here before. Perhaps that book of yours is a travel diary? I do seem possessed of a certain wanderlust. The normal sort as well. Ooh, perhaps I'll find a train of ex-lovers here among the sands. Let's be off. We make so. All present, Lord Marshal. Save the usual two, at least. No matter. Let's begin. I trust word has reached you from Kaldisla. The Knights of the Eternian Sky have fallen to the Vestal. I'd not thought the girl so bloodthirsty as all that. It appears she surrounded herself with capable guards. What's more, it pains me to say it, but Idea's whereabouts have been lost amid the chaos. That is no concern of yours. Do not confuse personal matters with your assigned task, Alternus. My apologies, Lord Marshal. Not only did the Sky Knights fail, they've given the Vestal wings. Why they didn't simply kill the child, I'll never know. Keenly insightful as ever, Victoria. Yet I fear we need of the Vestal alive. Have we, Victor? Ah, no matter then. If she fled by air, it's a simple matter to track her. She makes for Anshine by necessity. And to the Temple of Wind. Anshine does face upon the Florshine Sea. Of course. Most of the world's seas have gone putrid, but the inner sea remains navigable. That would offer the airship a berth. But what does she aim to do there? Why return to the crystal now? It smells of some sinister plot. Anshine is the province of the Kammer and Profiteur merchantry. What say you, Lord Marshal? We haven't the leisure of chasing the Vestal across the globe and back. We need her in custody now. Tell the merchantry to employ any means they must. <sighs> Having trouble wrecking up street passes, net a friend. Just think whether you can connect and find me guests to aid you. Council of Six is growing desperate. Those were their words. I've relayed them to you. My contract states I'm to receive payment for my troubles from you. Then your contract is mistaken. I've heard nothing of your sort. Bah, fine. You'll have your fee. But I am taking this small discount. Only fair as a regular customer, eh? If you must. Still, this vestal is quite the little monster now. Do have this sky knight, so I'm done. If the 
mountain is high enough, I would tackle a behemoth barehanded. But until I see a profit, I'll not move an inch. Business is business, yes? Mm. Ain't really nothing I want to buy. I think last time I checked, I bought everything I wanted to buy. Like this, I can't even tell you when the last time I played this. Ring a bell. Yeah, we good. Gauntless, they don't really do nothing right now.
Oh, we got these. Might as well buy the whole shop. Got the, got the money for it. It's showing up in the stream. I got see them when I type them, but half the time they don't. I have to try to retype it until they do. Oh. Onyas oblige, vessel of wind. His Majesty bids you come. Terrible accident. So, 
What of the Caldislan Castle? I fear it was worse even than your majesty had imagined. So tell me, was it worse than the state of your own nation? Are you even aware of the situation here? The wind remains still. And the Grand Mill be calm. I'm pleased to see you're not totally ignorant. The turbines that form the heart of this kingdom, the greatest symbols of her wisdom, now turn my hand. The hands of our citizens, compulsory labor service. Our survival hinges now upon their sacrifice. And even that will not last forever. We need that mill turning again soon. Not by our citizens' hands, but by the wind. And whose job is it to see that the wind blows, if not the vessel? I can think of no other value you provide, save that. Anyway, will you now end the suffering your negligence has caused to this land? To its people? Or is that beyond your abilities? Perhaps you would sooner run again, turn away from the plight of your people. If that is all his majesty wished to say, I'll be on my way. I haven't the time to waste here. What? You can... I'll not be spoken to like this! Just whose fault do you think this mess is, girl? That could have gone better. Not that I blame you for getting mad. Mad? I felt no anger. Only... fear. The king frightens me. His tone was far from pleasant. But he didn't seem dangerous. The people who had come to hear him speak frighten me the same. Everyone in this city, they see me only as the Vestal. Not a human being. I don't know how to speak to them. Mind you, this game is like years old, so the voice acting is uh, kind of bad. That explains the tense look you've worn since we've landed here. Personally, I felt amazing after that little conversation. Did you see his face? It was purple. I nearly laughed out loud. I tuned him out about halfway through his speech myself. I never did have much attention span for listening to men go on. In any case, We'd best hurry to the temple. It's all that I can do. So the blue marks on the map. Notice the blue marks on the map. Head there to advance a sub scenario. Sub scenarios are your chance to see other side of characters, other side of the asteroid bearers. Follow their stories and lay claim to their asteroids to unlock powerful new jobs. Okay, bet. Water possible. The results are clear. <laughs> what are you, my Ah, but I have lost the time again. I have appointments waiting, my friends. Let us speak again soon. Guard! Our honored guests are leaving. See they are seen out. Have a refreshing day. So was it it? <sighs> Feel 
feeling parched. Can we stop for a drink of water? You, stop. This well is property of the Cameron Profiteur Merchantry. Unauthorized withdrawals are strictly prohibited. Ah! Withdrawals? There are people out here going thirsty! No, there are peasants going thirsty. If you want a free drink so badly, go join the other rabble at the Oasis. Free drink, go to the oasis. This was voice acting back then. Do you know where these thieves are now? The, the, they're right behind you. Let's see. Two, four, six, and maybe forty in all. It's funny though. Plans, boys. We're done here. Wait! Leave the goods you stole! Not familiar with how thieving works, then? I'm cross enough already. And to heck with this thirst. The needles in my throat are driving me mad! I need a drink. This anger won't leave me till this thirst has. We're out, boys! Hey! I said wait! Stop, Diz. I feel the same, but there are too many. We can't take them head on. I forgot how how the battles in this game go. I'm, I'm gonna be honest, I, I completely forgot. Oh, it's right. You have to set the moves first.
I can't tell you about none of this. I, I really don't remember how to play this. This one was supposed to be going. Guess this is where I'm supposed to be going. Oh, what the hell is this? Fin first. No, no, no. We gotta. I remember. Raise the BP. It's like the actions that like we need that for the, for the actions. That's wild. Yeah, 
No noticing she don't have no healing magic. He got it. It's a chest here. I'll probably come back for it. I just want to beat this section. Oh, we got the chest. Okay. You run. fight if I don't have to. What's this thing again? Just let me know how many chests they have on the map. some more potions out the wall. Wait a minute, did any of them got here? They, they did. 
It's a good thing I checked. There's a I think this is why I stopped playing the game in the first place. I wasn't a fan of the combat. So different. Effect on a quick nullify poison, okay. Nullify sleep. We gotta put those on.
Ether, okay, good. I needed that. She don't have no health. I'm gonna have to go back and build all these characters up. Cause she has no health. Like none. what he got potions just a bunch of potions he doesn't have anything that's not actually gonna help me I need more ethers Why the hell is he gonna just silence me and I'm and I had the moves first? Oh, man. 
no senso. What's this now? The ones from the Oasis, is it? You're the rat sneaking about the place? Why do you persist in these awful t You must return the articles you stole! <sighs> One of you muzzle this dog's yapping, would you? And what? Don't tell me you came all this way just to vomit a few platitudes out on my floor. <laughs> this place is nothing but sand and hypocrites. Drives a man mad, and this thirst... These daggers in my throat. All the water in the desert can't dull their edge. The people you robbed at the Oasis were thirsty, too. They risked their lives to get at that water, and you... Ah, spare me the lecture. You come to convert me? Set me on the straight and narrow? Teach me to follow the rules? Be a good little sheep? Live an honest life? <laughs> Out here, honest lives end quick. The desert's a beast, and it's always hungry. The city's no different. There are only two kinds of folk in this world, make no mistake. The takers and the taken from. My worthless parents were easy marks. Textbook victims. And still, they grit their teeth and tried hard as they could to get through each day. Till the day came they couldn't feed a family of three. So they cut loose their kid and disappeared. They just left you? The city just took and took till they had nothing left. Their own brat became a burden, so they dumped him like a bag of sand. Daft, eh? Absolutely stupid. If surviving means pinching from other folk, I'll happily join the Takers. Are you sure they left because you were a burden to them? Maybe they swallowed their tears and left you in the city, in hopes that you, at least, could find happiness there. Aye. Or maybe they left me because they didn't have the guts to kill me themselves. You don't know a stinking thing about them. You're right. I don't know their reasons. But they do. If they're still alive, you can go and ask them. You can track them down and make them explain themselves. Make them answer for their choices. You can yell and scream and fight as long as you like. As long as it takes. You can work on forgiving them. But you haven't done any of that. You've stayed here sulking and festering all your life. That's far dafter to me! My throat! This accursed thirst is worse than ever. You, this is your fault! You smug, delusional, self-righteous little lambs make me sick! I'll take everything, everything from you! Oi, Chief! Kent, get your horns in here! Oh, it's that lady that delivered that message. That lady, wow. That bodyguard that delivered the message. Aye, that's enough words. I'm choking on this lot's hypocrisy. I want them stripped to the bone. I care nothing for your reasons and still less for your ideals. My assistance hinges only on the weight of your coin purse. She's heavy enough. You'll have your pay. Then we have a contract, and you will have your money's worth. <laughs> 